Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einer neuen Spielevorstellung bei uns auf dem Kanal. Das Spiel nennt sich Identity 5. Sein absoluter Oberbrüller. Ähm, was ganz Spezielles. Wir schauen uns das Ganze dann mal an. Ich muss mal gucken, ob das hier geht. Gucken, ob das funktioniert. Das geht natürlich nicht. Okay. Dann muss ich mal folgendes machen. So, gucken wir mal. Jawohl, das geht. Okay. Invalid Characters. Wahrscheinlich die Leerzeichen, oder was? Gut, dann machen wir mal die Leerzeichen raus. Dann gucken wir mal, was jetzt passiert. Ja, selbstverständlich. Somewhere that's been deserted for ten years. This room's in remarkable condition. I think I'll stay here for the night. But it's too dark in here. I need to find an alternative light source before the fuel of this lantern runs out. So, ich muss jetzt hier erstmal, ach, ich muss den, den Fußspuren folgen und ich soll eine Lichtquelle erstmal finden, okay? Dann schauen wir mal. Da ist das Licht, okay. Thank God. Candles here still burn. There should be some more on the wall. Okay, auch hier wieder den Fußspuren folgen. Ah. Glaubt mir eins, Leute, bleibt dran. Bleibt wirklich dran, weil das Ding hier entwickelt sich zu einem richtigen Oberknaller. Es ist nicht ein, es ist kein Adventure-Spiel. Ich weiß, es ist alles psychologisch. Diese Kandeln sind wirklich kalm die Nerven. Es ist kein Adventure-Spiel, wie gesagt. Wartet's ab, was euch erwartet. Paper Airplane? Something that children usually play with. Someone was probably playing around and it got caught up there. Then a rat, scared by the light, shook it from the lamp. Who made it though? from my initial analysis. The paper used might actually contain some information from which I might find other clues. This looks like a page from a diary. Interesting. The date is from several days ago. The person who wrote this is most likely connected with our missing person. Although I can't write anymore, I still have an 
uncanny ability since the emotions of a text. This is an ability most people do not possess. By reading the text, I can attempt to reconstruct the scene and you can find out information about the author. Description mentioned an attic attached to the main house, located some distance away. I think we are still at the manor, but it seems we're some distance from the main house. For now, I need to focus and retrace the steps of our mystery author. I should probably drink less. <laughs> Judging from the content, my guess would be that our author is male, right-handed, and of average education. From here onwards, the writing becomes even more wild and illegible. Fear has stripped him of his ability to describe his encounter with any logic, as if something was hunting him. suddenly stops here. What on earth does that mean? Carnival. It reads like something that was written by a lunatic. I really hope that Mr. Reichenbach's daughter is not involved in this. What I really need to do now is find the rest of the diary and find out what's happened to her. There should be other clues among these sheets of paper. The 
black powder seems to be charcoal. Hmm. The answer is probably close by. There happens to be a fireplace here. Please forgive my abruptness. I'm your most loyal reader, devouring all your works, every incredible stories. I feel sorry for the misfortunes you have suffered. As a private detective, you have got experiences beyond comparison in the field of crime deduction. Please forgive my presumptuousness once again. Generally, commissions like this should be entrusted in person. But I could not leave my wife's with her illness. Our daughter disappeared three days ago. That torture us in these days. I would not trouble you if it had been just a normal kidnapping. While her missing was completely out of the ordinary, she was snatched right off her aunt's empty house in the countryside. Then someone saw her miles away on the same day. At first, we thought the witness was just a fake one for ransom. Th though, it turned out that was the only clue we ever found. Soon we realized a serious situation. The place she spotted was right near that infamous manor. It hurt us when we found her clothes in the bushes around the manor. Also, hier geht's um eine Tochter, die äh, seit drei Tagen vermisst wird und die hier in der Gegend bei diesem verrückten Haus das letzte Mal gesehen wurde. Und ihre Klamotten wurden in einem Busch gefunden. I'm not a superstitious person, but something did happen in the manor that no one wants to mention. The response from the local police was disturbing. I don't know whose approval they need before searching the manor. However, I do feel the fear through their hesitation. Worse than I suffered, my wife ultimately surrendered to disease without our daughter. Endless as it seems, it could no longer trust anyone there either. So I ask for your help to investigate that manor for our lost angel. I am willing to give up my entire fortune for our daughter. Even if, my god, the worst has already happened, we still hope that you could find out who has done this evil. We will pay whatever the price for any clue. I look forward to your respond with mail or telegram as soon as possible. In addition to the portrait of our daughter and the clothing, let the enclosed check indicate my admiration for you. Please use it for your lodging and travel expenses. Your loyal reader, James Reichenbach. So, okay. Also. They don't even know who to spell, how to spell rules. Thank God I wasn't the first one to try that. It's pure madness. Why did he attack me? I just wanted to go see my poor guy who was eliminated. There was no reason for him to chase me. Also, wir, wir sind privat Detektive und äh, oder ein Privatdetektiv und sind beauftragt worden, von diesem Reichenbach die Tochter zu finden. Ah, okay. Also jetzt gehen wir mal hier unten hin. Major Q. There's charcoal in the fireplace, but no diary. That's not surprising. But something else has attracted my attention. The unburned firewood. The chimney has been sealed off. Seems the owner didn't use the fireplace. And its true purpose remains unclear. There must be some more clues around here. This candlestick is... I think I know why there's an extra candle here. It's firmly attached to the fireplace. It seems to actually be a part of the fireplace. 
This is pretty important. Tja, ich gehe mal davon aus, dass du das Ding umlegen kannst. Und dann geht dieser Kamin auf. When the wall stopped rotating, about 100 books that looked almost exactly the same come into focus. Intuition told me that the page that I was holding in my hand came from one of these books, and it was a simple bum -bum -bum. I used to detest bedtime reading when I was a child. Trying to find a diary with a missing page in here is like looking for a needle in a haystack. The search for one specific diary is no longer important. All of these diaries are significant. I have never seen anything so odd. It is obvious that these entries were not written by the same person, which means that they were insane, or something else happened here that I do not yet understand. Hmm. They've raised more questions than they have answered. It seems I shall have to apply a somewhat archaic method to obtain the information that I need. Rennen, Mann, rennen! Erstmal rausgekommen. I think I can catalog the particulars of all the authors into profiles based on the information I found.
A few scattered diaries is connected. I think they're describing the same game. According to this entry, the author describing this game is a doctor. The entry from this doctor is more detailed and complete. I think this would be a good place to begin. Hier ist eine. Jetzt hat er mich gefangen. Verdammt nochmal, er hat mich gefangen. Aber ich krieg geholfen, wie es aussieht. Verdammt nochmal, jetzt hat er mich schon wieder, ey. Ich muss besser aufpassen irgendwie. Da kommt er schon wieder. Ich muss irgendwie besser aufpassen. So ist der Typ jetzt hier. Das jetzt hier, müssen wir es jetzt schaffen. Ah, der hilft mir jetzt. Okay. Komm, jetzt haben wir gepackt. Ein Cypher noch. Müssen wir es schaffen? Auf geht's. Komm. Komm. 
Nicht heilen. Das Ding. Man das heißt nicht heilen. Das gibt's doch nicht. Ja, wir haben es alle geschafft. Alle raus. Sehr gut. Okay. Escaped. Dr. Emily Dyer. perspective. So, jetzt wollen wir erstmal hier mit diesem ersten Teil Schluss machen. Wenn es euch gefallen hat und wenn ihr wissen wollt, wie es weitergeht, dann lasst mal ein Like da, schreibt was in die Kommentare. Abonniert den Kanal, falls ihr es noch nicht getan haben solltet und schaltet das nächste Mal wieder ein, wenn es wieder heißt Identity 5. Mit mir dem Herrn Gleich, macht's gut, bis dann und tschüss.